Don't you just love that song? I do. It warms the cockles of my heart. But, you know, last week, I'm thinking Sting comes out. He hands a pair of wrestling boots to my son, Garrett. And all of a sudden, Garrett thinks he's a wrestler. He's made it. His dreams have come true. Not so, not so, not so. You see, Garrett, I don't blame you for having the dream of becoming a wrestler. I don't blame you at all. It's a lot like Eddie Van Halen and, and Slash. I mean, they make shredding a guitar look really easy. I mean, you watch them and you think, hell, I can do that. But they're very, very uniquely talented and gifted individuals just like me. And Garrett, you've grown up your whole life watching me make millions upon millions of dollars, reinvent the wrestling business, build a company to be the number one wrestling company on planet Earth, and I made it look easy in the process because I'm that good. So I don't blame you. But Garrett, in the process of building companies and making millions and millions of dollars, I scorched the earth behind me. I burned and destroyed anything and everything that didn't benefit me, including the people I've worked with, and there's a lot of them. Which is why, Garrett, you have no future in this business. You have no friends in this business. So I encourage you, Garrett, to give up your dreams because your dreams are going to get you hurt. huge moment it had to be in the life of your son Garrett last Thursday, Sting removing him from the referee's crew, mentioned symbolically handing him the pair of wrestling boots, and then officially adding him to the roster as a wrestler. You get that stamp of approval from Sting, it's so big. Oh God, and Garrett's face when he saw those boots handed to him by Sting, the kid lit up. He lit up so you could see his goals and aspirations just when those boots were handed to him. So let me get this straight. You want me to give up all my dreams, my goals and ambitions, because you come out here and say so? Because you've burned all your bridges? I haven't burned all of mine. And I have friends. That's right. And I'm not going anywhere. Now, I said it last week, and I'll say it again. I am proud to be in this ring. I am proud to be in this building, working with and learning from all the great ones like Sting, like James Storm, like Jeff Hardy and AJ. And that's what I'm gonna continue to do. And not you or anybody else is gonna take that away from me. And you tried when you had Gunner send me out of here on a stretcher, but I came back. You can have him come back down here tonight and do it again, and he may beat the living hell out of me, but I'll come back. And then you can have him come down and do it again. And I'm going to keep coming back, because that's what I do. Oh, oh, wait. By the way, I have a new trainer. You'll be shocked to find out who he is. Have a nice night.
your hands. Got me get. Got it. Did you expect that reaction? No, no, I did not. From Garrett Bischoff? No, I did not. What was, so what was this trainer? Who was he talking about? Uh, I, don't, I don't know, but you heard what he told Eric Bischoff. You're going to be shocked when you find out who it is. I'll tell you, Big Daddy is angry. Eric Bischoff is boiling living. <laughs>